Kumo desu ka nani ka? Chapter 85. Wow, just like, wow, I've done a lot of these. <laughs> Spider vs. Fire Drake, end. The eel wriggle its long body. Yeah. In the offense and defense so far, the eel seems to be quite cautious of me. Although not as much as the monkey, this eel is smarter than the other monsters. That alone makes it hard for me to act. Skill proficiency reached still so thought, eh. Uh. Skill Thought Acceleration Level 2 has become Thought Acceleration Level 3. It's, I'm a little rusty, haven't done this in a while. <laughs> skill Proficiency Reach Skill Foresight Level 2 has become Foresight Level 3. The eel moved, matching the voice of heaven, wriggling its body and strike with its tail. Of course I evade it, but the eel's attack doesn't end here. Immediately, its tail sweeps sideways to attack me. I fall back further and evade it. This time it pulls back its tail and goes towards me. I've been waiting for that. It, in the somewhat slow word world caused by the thought acceleration, I stare at the approaching eel's mouth. I judge that I can't avoid it, so I activate poison synthesis at the last moment. I withdraw at once. It's the same strategy used on the catfish, but the effect is tremendous. The eel tastes on my deadly poison as planned. The eel's HP decreases rapidly. The painfully struggling eel acts violently in random. I withdraw from the range of its rage. In the end, if both have the offensive ability and the same one-hit kill, then there's one who hits first wins. If that's the case, then how to make the attack hits? The one with the great strategy will win. In addition, my evasion ability is better than the eel's accuracy. Even if it has the power of accuracy level 10 and probability correction, it won't reach my evasion, thought acceleration, and foresight combo. Therefore, when I drag the eel out to the ground, my winning percentage increased a lot. But it's not ended yet. Although I said that it's a one-hit kill, the eel probably doesn't die in that hit. Even the catfish didn't die by a hit, so there's no way the higher rank, which is the eel, will die. Besides, the eel still has the power of that skill. The eel's HP recovers hap eh, happily. Jesus, I get distracted and just whatever. Rapidly in front of me. Life transition consumes SP to recover HP. The level 3 technique of Fire Drake. SP is consumed and HP recovers equivalent to that. Although it's impossible for it to recover its HP fully with its current SP, it's in it can secure enough HP to endure the deadly poison. Furthermore, in the appraisal of result of the eel, poison resistance level 1 and automatic HP recovery level 1 are newly added. Still, the poison in its body reduces its HP little by little with the damage peak ended. Well, there's no way that I will wait for the, its revival without doing anything. I wrap the eel's body with the thread that's made it as strong as possible. Still, it will probably burn out at once, but it doesn't matter. I just need to stop the eel's movement for a moment. As planned, I succeeded in stopping its movement for a moment. In that moment, I activate poison synthesis, eel aiming at the eel's face in rapid succession. Many drops of deadly poison hit the eel's face. The eel te tears the thread off the and rages. The poison that invaded from the mouth and eyes decreased the eel's HP without mercy. The speed is not on the level that the newly acquired automatic recovery can do something about it. The power is not on the level that the newly acquired poison resistance can endure it. This weapon that I have sharpened in my life as a spider is not easy to protect with just a shield that's made instantly. The eel that doesn't have the SP to recover its HP can never endure this attack. Experience points has reached a certain degree. Individual small poison terror attack level 7 has become level 8. Every basic ability rose. Level up bonus skill, skill proficiency was acquired. Skill proficiency reached. Skill parallel thought level 4 has become parallel thought level 5. Skill proficiency reached. Skill SP consumption down level 2 has become SP consumption down level 3. Skill points gained. Experience points has reached a certain degree. Individual small poison terror attack level 8 has become level 9. Every basic ability rose. Level up bonus skill, skill proficiency was acquired. Skill proficiency reached. Skill agility level 8 is become agility level 9. Skill proficiency reached. Skill endurance level 8 has become endurance level 9. Skill points gained. Experience points has reached a certain degree. Individual small poison terror attack level 9 has become level 10. Every basic ability rose. Level up bonus skill, skill proficiency was acquired. Skill proficiency reached. Skill calculation processing level 6 has become calculation processing level 7. Skill proficiency reached. Skill enhanced vision level 8 has become enhanced vision level 9. Skill proficiency reached. Skill life level 8 has become life level 9. Skill points gained. Conditions met. Individual small poison terror attack can evolve. I won! The third part completed. Um, hmm. Okay. <laughs> That's probably... Um, third, third part. There was like six, six parts to this though. What? Huh. Third part. Maybe, maybe that's, that might be, uh, cause that was her third evolution. I think what happened there is, it might be a translation thing, but I think third part completed is probably because that was her, 
her third stage because she was the one and then the second one and this is her third stage and now it's completed and now she can evolve i i it might be something like that the blastron probably has a more uh a line that makes more sense or just completely omits it i don't know <laughs> that's my guess though